Imagine walking through the fern forests during the late Permian. It is a truly bizarre place and you see many animals that are unfamiliar pass by. You hear a rustle and instinctively look up to the treetops and you're faced with a bizarre creature unlike anything you've ever seen before. Or is it? Actually, now that you look at it, it resembles a squirrel or a monkey of some sort, but something about it is different. You have just come face to face with a Suminia. But Colsaurus, I hear you guys say, what the heck is a Suminia? And that, my friends, is where it gets interesting. Sunimia jatnamovi was a Permian synapsid, but it was unlike other Permian synapsids. It was perhaps the first ever arboreal synapsid, showing many signs of being arboreal, such as elongated limbs and even a prehensile tail. Unlike other synapsids, such as this Ophicoodon, Sunimia was actually an herbivore, feeding on nuts, seeds, and fruit. Unfortunately, not much else is known about Sunimia. But fortunately, people have speculated. Many people think that it had a life similar of a New World monkey, and maybe it could have evolved to be something like today's apes. To wrap up this creature of the week, here is my reconstruction of Suminia, sporting speculative hair and nice opposable thumbs. If any of you guys have suggestions for future creature of the weeks, go ahead and leave them in the comments, and have a nice day. See you later.